drivers behind the lines. And three, two, one, go. All right, here we go. Second round match. Match number eight, it's autonomous, still in the upper bracket. So the winner stays in the upper bracket. The losing alliance will go to the lower bracket. So no one gets eliminated from this match. And we finish autonomous, advantage blue. We enter into the teleoperator mode. The drivers have control of the robots. Everybody is moving. Blue's got about an eight point lead here in the early going. So Robo Jackets with the cone at the middle level. Cyber Knights cone at the upper level, both for red. Killer Bees and Strike Force both scoring on the blue side. But the Blue Alliance with about a 15 point lead at this early going, about a minute and a half left in the match. Another score by the Killer Bees with a cone at the top level. Their partner Sabre Robotics dropping a cube off at the bottom level. Strike Force for Blue with a cone at the top level. Sabre with another, cone, with another cube down at the bottom level, although that's over the line. Little more than a minute remaining. Slight advantage, about nine points for the Blue Alliance. We're now under a minute. Strike Force again, scoring a cone. Saber spinning another cube into the lower level, goes into one of the sections that there already was a cube. We're down to about 40 seconds to go. Nine point advantage, or four point advantage for the Blue Alliance. Killer Bees dropping a cone off at the lower level. We enter into the end game. Under half a minute remaining in this match. It's still pretty tight, about a 10 point lead for the Blue Alliance. Remember the winner stays in the upper bracket. The, low, the loser will go into the lower bracket. So no one gets eliminated after this match. 10 seconds remaining, one blue robot already on the charger ramp. Now the other two joining it. All three red robots up and balanced. All three blue ones up and balanced as well. So everybody docked and engaged at the end of that match. But it's tight. It shows on the real-time scoring, which is unofficial, that the, blue, the red alliance has a three-point lead. We don't know how official that number is. Remember, that's unofficial. Referees are going to have to verify that. And let's see what the referees say. This is a tight match. All right, we've got a score coming up. And it shows the Red Alliance takes this match. They win by a score of 205 to 199. So the Red Alliance, Alliance number seven, is gonna stay in the upper bracket. They are going to advance to round four, match number 11. And the Blue Alliance, Alliance six, goes to the lower bracket. That's going to be in ma match number 10. So another close match here in the playoffs.